Hello friends and welcome to our video on how to pass data into child component in Vue.js. Before we move forward, please do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also press the bell icon so that you don't miss on any new notifications of any new videos or series that we put across. Now let's understand this with an example. Let's suppose this is the user list component where the title that is passed inside the card component is a dynamic value and I want this to be passed from the parent component and leave the logic of what title has to be displayed. There can be there can be two more more than one scenarios where we can say that uh, the use the list that is being displayed is an admin user list or let's say as employee list or whatever. So that logic should be there in the parent component and we uh, we want to get that value from the parent component now how to do it is we need to accept some parameters inside our child component and to list all the uh, attributes or say properties that we want to accept inside the child component we need to have a property props array overhead declared and this should this this should mention all the properties or attributes that we would be uh, expecting from the parent component so uh, component title let's say i am i i would be expecting a component title and i would want to bind that component title to the title that is being displayed over here and now to pass that component title this is the component title that is the way exact name that we have given inside the property equal to some value let's say user now this user is a constant value that we are supplying to this so the mistake that I have committed is this is a variable not a constant string so I should do a bind event on the title so when you apply an on bind functionality then it takes in the parameter as an uh, variable and it would act accordingly and it would bind the value that is there inside the variable to this property but if you don't do a bind then it would expect a constant string and it would not want this to be interpolated or changing so i've used this as binding i've passed some value into component title and now let's see uh, employee i have just changed employee and this gets automatically reflected on the card title so let's try and change by employee from employee to let's say parent so it gets changed to the parent so whatever value you want to pass into this gets changed now this is something that is uh, we are passing a constant value that's a constant string now, now what happens if i want to pass a value that is inside a variable so as we have already seen this how to pass it in the uh, card title so but still we will have one more variable created where I'll say uh, HTML so let's see how we can accept this HTML from here and let's see HTML and we'll do a bind on the variable that is HTML where that we already have created this HTML where contains a small span high there and that's the html variable that the value inside the html variable now this gets passed to the html now let's display this somewhere i will display it as let's let's leave it and just do an interpolate and leave the logic to you whatever you want so if you can see before the user list component we have also got the span high there now i have not done the html binding as we have done over here in this div so that is why it is also displaying the span but if i convert this to this html so it will convert that 
to H, uh, convert that span to HTML tag and then bind it inside the div. So this is how you can pass value inside a component using the prop property uh, property attribute inside the component. Thank you for watching the video. Please do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also press the bell icon so that you don't miss on any notifications of any new videos or series that we put forward. We would love to hear from you of any feedbacks or any any uh, tutorial that you want us to do of any specific features of the language which we have put across or any new language that you want us to uh, make videos on. So we would appreciate if you can uh, comment on the videos and uh, we would definitely reach out and look forward to uh, answer your queries.